Ray Give TV exclusive. Yo, Ping Ray in here, bro. He just popped in. There it go. Somebody oh, must six go. so about none of that. Ray Shout out, Devil. Don't get my real 40. Uh oh, we got exclusive content. Gets heated in here. Full audio. It's your boy Ray Give. Let's get to it. Well, you need to spend the block with the homie Ray Give TV, the hardest working clubhouse YouTuber in the game. Hey, yo, Ray, let's get to the content. It's Ray, Ray Give TV. In the block. This, this, that he was on a timer. I mean, he know I don't be understanding none of that. So my whole thing is that that was the case, bro. It happens, so. It does. It happens, so. it, 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 well, I say, however it work, yo, yo, however that work, right. you know what we just talked about. Right. Why not snatch it? You hear what I'm saying? Right. That's your page. You run your page. Whoever run, hey, me and homie, hey, cancel that. You get what I'm saying? So that's when I like, all right, nigga, you, you still trying to act like, you know what I mean? Yo, whack. What's the word? He said, like, man, it's just a little internet game. I don't, you know, I don't know no games. Like, you know, right, right. I don't, I don't play the internet. So, I'm like, but, like, you no, know, the internet. That, that's what, you know. So I'm like, all right, you wanna play like this? Because now you playing with my energy. Like, now, now you playing with my name. Like, you and you calling me out by name and this, that, and the third. And you know, just, just so I'm like, all right, there, nigga. You know. But at the same time, I do feel that like that was petty. But at the same time, like, I'm, I'm protecting myself. Like, I'm, I'm a, I'm a whole image out here. You get what I'm saying? So like, it, it don't make it seem like it's up, or you just you just doing this when in, in actuality you was on some humble shit. We both we, we both was right. Not not saying because I wasn't getting at him crazy. I wasn't disrespecting him. I was talking to him, and I thought we had a um. Yeah, from what I heard, the conversation was was pretty cordial. Yeah, yeah. It's, so so first first and foremost, man, that's the homie. You get what I'm saying? So my my so as far you, you as can far, stop it right there, Nisha. Should... Like you know what I'm saying? My first my first thing. Hey Nisha, play the other clip real quick. Yo, whack, what's the word? What other yeah, it's the actual phone call right now. What up, bro? Hey, we gonna uh, get into this Yael shit, but I don't know if you heard this shit. Hey, hey can you play that on um, Baby Runner versus Brick Baby? So they turned up. Let yeah, you know baby, ba right, baby Runner gonna Baby Runner gonna side with his homies off the rip. Yeah, he said Brick he Baby got two, Brick Baby got two two things he got we can do. He gonna handle it in the streets. See, now we gonna see if he can handle the whack shit. Right, cause see now this is what come with it. I don't think Brick Baby made for this shit at all, cause the nigga cried. He break it down. Hey, you, he think he, you think it he down. Could cry? I don't think so. He cried. Ain't no think he cried. He cried. They, I'm trying to get the other video where he got yoked up. Yeah, they ain't wrong, y'all. Politic bitch, sad on no jumper. So shit, they can politic you. What you mean you ain't? And what's crazy? We took two weeks off. I ain't even start playing with him. When I get on my platform, I'm going to play with him, play with him. <laughs> get Adam on already. Adam said, you know I can't control whack with me in that room. It's Ray Gift TV. In the block. Baby Runner said he want that fade. And then he said he could go somewhere else. If not, but then Brick Baby saying like, oh, yeah, do that. He like, he going to shut down no jump. He like, do that, do that, and all that. You know what I'm saying? My thing is, though, bro, is like, how did it escalate to this? Like, from what I understand, like, I'm not from Cali, bro. But if if you from the same hood, like, if you a blood, it's up to you, of course. Or you a crip, it's up to you, of course, to give that person that fade. Right? Ain't that how it go, Rich? Yeah, but he don't have to give, he don't have to give Baby Runner a fade because Baby Runner from 40s and he from 60s. It's already a contentious relationship between the 40s and the 60s because it's been bloodshed in the last few years. And these relationships- Man, that ain't been, got nothing to do with nothing, bro. Yeah, that has nothing to do with nothing. No, well, no, nah, nah, hold on, bro. Hold on, bro, let's, let's keep it real, let's keep it real. Brick is trying to make it that. The Fodies is addressing, you let a nigga diss neighborhood. He lucky is just the Fodies addressing it, right? This ain't got nothing to get. Brick ain't big enough to get that going. That what they see spiral. He ain't big enough to do that because half his neighborhood is telling him what the fuck is you doing over there on that platform on social media. You putting yourself in the cross, right? So now you didn't let a nigga diss neighborhood. See, that's bigger than just the 60s. Right? No, so that's a, what I said. A 40 got a right, right. A 40 got a right 
to address him and they gonna say homie you let that happen that one nigga right there wanna holla at you you gotta face that Brick ain't in position that four extras and Spody is in. They whole neighborhood stand with them. Brick yeah. whole neighborhood don't stand with him right now. Right? Yeah, that's a fact. That's he, a fact. He's not going to be able to stand the rain if baby running them gets you calling in the block. Oh, six so nigga. I don't give a fuck about none of that, nigga. Shout out Devil Donut, nigga, in my real 40s, cuz. These niggas 68ers, though, nigga. On 6-0, and this my homeboy, nigga. On the hood. And whatever me and my homeboy gotta go through, nigga, to clear what we gotta clear, nigga, on 6 he gonna always be my homeboy, nigga. It don't matter whatever it is, nigga. But the energy that, nigga, from now on, nigga, keep on running content on my name, nigga. I'm putting the squad in the street. Wait a minute. Squad? What? Boy, you moving like that out there, Brick Baby? Mm -mm -mm. Do you guys believe this man right now? Drop a comment down below. It's your boy Ray Give. Let's get back to it. Nigga on 6 0. Y'all forgot I had Chili, nigga. Nigga on 6 0, nigga. Go, go, go look up, nigga. What, what, what shitty work? Niggas from the hood that keep talking. Y'all know why y'all talking, cuz. Cuz the boogeyman spoke, nigga. And y'all scared, nigga. You niggas wanna do shit on camera. But it's over with. I'm, I ain't finna keep going up, nigga. But the energy is what it is, cuz. And on the dead homies, send the link to cuz. On the dead homies, be outside, nigga. Play that shit today, nigga. Hold up, hold up. He said the boogeyman. Are you for real? I mean, I can tell he's very passionate in what he's saying. But do you believe this guy? Drop a comment down below. It's your boy right here. Let's get back to it. The people I choose usually can, can, can hold their own. You get what I'm saying? Because I know vibes, bro. A nigga can tell me anything about somebody and I'm never going to believe it till I get around him and see it. I'm telling you, because everybody is macho man until you meet him. Facts. You get what I'm saying? I'm a low old nigga. My name ring bells, man. Pay attention. I don't want to live that life. Then, to clear something up off the rip, I told Gordy to troll like that at the beginning of the show to the world. Yeah, all right, oh, yeah. So look, niggas was mad at Gordy. They was like, "Yo, that nigga Gordy." And you know him. You know when he's saying, trolling. Hold on, hold on. I said, you know when he's playing. You, look, if you know me, you know. You know, saying, look, Gordy was before on some we break shit. all that down, I look. said this is a nigga who rides around with Brick every day. Yeah, Do you think he was gonna say anything on his show that they hadn't already talked about? It's common sense. Yeah. So you can tell the homies and my fans coming for Gordy. Listen. I never watched. Can I be honest with y'all? I didn't watch the Tuesday show till I got on the plane yesterday. So I never seen the first question of the Tuesday show was about this drama that, that was just talked about on Here We Go Again. It kind of rubbed me the wrong way. Because if a nigga asked me about my hood being off brand more than once, I'm liable to diss the next time. Right. And say fuck all them niggas. And it is what it is. Because you dig it. I want them to pressure up. You dig it. And you know this my homeboy. So why is you digging with my homeboy, nigga? You know I talk crazy to my to, to the whole world. I talk crazy off this motherfucker. When I'm talking to my homeboys, I talk with all the lingo. Don't think I don't. If you my enemy homeboy, don't be my friend no more. You get what I'm saying? Hmm. No. No. Oh yeah. Yeah. Tight shit. Alright, nigga, niggas better know. Niggas better be sure. Talking yes, about some nah. Fuck you, uh, no, you better know. Talk about it, uh. <laughs> you feel me? You gotta know. I do want to know. I'm just saying, in these times, you gotta know. I do want to add. Coming, nigga. I do want to add that when we had the conversation about the phone call on Here We Go Again, it was like a super chat. That I understand and that. Flame no, no, he's chat. saying no, that's he's cool. not saying that. He's saying no, he's that show. it's just, like I'm coming dragged on. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. But when it, but he, it he, came up on our yeah, show right. strictly because the super chat. That wasn't in right. our topics. Yeah. And me and this nigga said, "Shut the fuck up." But it got clipped. It got clipped, right? I'm just saying. No, no, no. I know, I know, I know. So I had to approach it as it being on your show because it got clipped. I know that you're not messy, bro. Not like that. That's the last year. Not what people hear. You rather talk about the rap beef between them two than talk about me and him. Yeah. Exactly right. right. So that's how I do know you. I, I I haven't been watching. So I know that he rather do music, whatever. That yeah. came up. Some messy shit came up on y'all show, USS show, whatever the case is. He responded, great to have heard one of his homeboys say some shit mm -hmm. on a phone call. Right. right. We clapped it up for him. Yeah. Facts. I was like, that's good. <clears throat> and if, as soon as a nigga say, I don't want to see it. 
We're not finna blow it up. But we didn't have it loaded up or nothing. You know what I'm saying? Facts type shit. Because like, hey, say what it's here, nigga. Leave it at that type shit. You feel me? So look, bow. DW. Goes on another show and gets asked about it. On home court. These both of these shows at home court. All right. First of all, I'd rather all the attention. I'm about to get to everything too. So <clears throat> just give me a second, guys. Let them land. So uh this home base. I feel like anything that goes on with me should not be content. Whatever you do in the public eye is gonna be made content. People is gonna react. So how can you say that, Brick Baby? Make it make sense. It's your boy Ray Give Drop. Coming down below. Let's get back to it. Cause I'm really out here fighting cases and doing type certain shit to where I don't feel like shit that goes on with me, we should even give these niggas the stepping stone to even because Adam, you you bailed me out, gang. You you know firsthand. So like I know that Brick Baby name go crazy and it's fucked up that we can't get the views that everybody else getting off of my motherfucking off of my controversy, but I don't feel like home base. The 60s ain't talking about it no more. Nigga, pay attention. Like, wow, Only niggas talking about it is these niggas that don't have nothing going on that ain't from my hood that nigga want to be seen. You're fueling that. Hire them niggas, cuz. I could go. I made way more money, nigga. I, I, I clear over damn near 700000 a year, my nigga, without even touching the microphone, cuz. I got a nigga that can vouch. I used to bust zippers off of backpacks, nigga, when we was in Atlanta. That's what we, that was our goal. Our goal was to, but, but fuck, fuck bust the seams off your pants. Let's bust, let's make sure that this backpack can't zip up, nigga. That's how we know we got enough. You get what I'm saying? Like, like, I'm not trying to say that. I'm not saying fuck me, let's go. Nigga got to start respecting that a real street nigga has came up here because his shit can't change. No shots to them other niggas that was up here. But Trail been clean for 10 years before he came up here. Nigga, AD been clean for 10 years before he came up here. They was well established with, with, with the shit. Guy here. I got cleared by the job. <laughs> the job saved me, I nigga. You, niggas took me off the street for Niggas real, for pulled real. me out the trenches. Thank you, Adam. Nigga, somebody believed in me. Why? That's why I said I love you, Adam. But I got to let it off my chest. The job saved me, nigga. Y'all looking at that? Like, goddamn, nigga, a nigga can't just do my job? A nigga got to act like I'm in the county still, nigga? The same shit that's been breaking me down my whole life? I have to do that while I'm at my job, too? I'm held to them standards? Like, come on, gang. That shit is weird. I everything good. That's weird, though. You get what I'm saying? Like, 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 nigga, tell him ain't nothing going on. Be good, my boy. Yeah, I don't want to be that. You get what I'm saying? That ain't what I want to be, nigga. Oh, look, you see, I changed the narrative. When the last time you seen me interview a nigga or a hood nigga at that, unless it's my homeboy that just came home and wanted his exposure, I owe him one. You get what I'm saying? You get what I'm saying? Nigga, I've been interviewing baddie after baddie after baddie, putting a baddie on my show, putting a South Central baddie. I'm trying to make sure that I don't go into no fucking gang politics at all. But you niggas want me to be Crip Mag. Y'all want me to bleed this shit on camera and that's not real gangbanging cuz I want to see you niggas wear all blue every day and fucking put a rag around you and keep on doing all the shit that he's doing in real life out in y'all hood. Do that every day and stand on the corner, please. How many days you think they got, sis? Nigga got a few hours. <laughs> Nigga got a few hours. This ain't too Let's be real, cuz. You can go to the 60s, niggas flamed up on purpose, my nigga. Let's be real. Come on, y'all know what the art of war is. Y'all know what the goal is. Don't nobody want to be stranded in that motherfucking war zone, nigga. Everybody want out, nigga. The fuck is you talking about? I've been shot in the neck, nigga. I've been shot in the tailbone. I've been shot in my bladder. Hey, you niggas ain't even been touched, nigga. I don't even know if you niggas really ran phase before, gang. Like, please leave me the fuck alone, cuz with all that gang banging and all that, and to Long Beach, I got one more thing to address. Because y'all taking it out of a proportion. I hate to get on gang politics, but since we are here and this is the new politic, this is the new penitentiary. Y'all want to come to the four yard politic at the table? Go to Adam table, nigga. You can say everything that goes on on the four yard. Yes, this is what y'all turned this into. 
whack and all you bitch ass niggas. This is what y'all let him in on. Cuz controls gang narratives. Cuz is a gang leader. He know all the shit. Cuz know all about every DP. Cuz know about every nigga who snitched from every hood. Cuz know about every nigga who got marked out. Cuz know about every nigga who got shot. How did we let this happen? Dead homies. Cuz is nigga. This is really LA. How are you niggas even sitting down and letting that happen? I go sit down and that bit my homeboy way before this though. You get what I'm saying? Like niggas don't understand. I didn't just come work for Adam. This been my homeboy. You get what I'm saying? Cuz know a little bit more about me just because cuz know me cuz. I didn't come up here and nigga venting to him. Cuz still got to get his intel through hearsay, gang. Now if he approached me with something and I want to laugh about it, I'll tell him. Like, damn, did this really happen? I'd be like, right. And I might tell him a story too. But me coming to air out my skeletons to Adam and vent to him, cuz that's not the nigga I'm going to for that. So how did we let this be the round table for gang politics? But Long Beach, once again, the insane, insane crib gang, ICG, Trace, no moving. But y'all do the movie song. Insane Crip Gang. Not Insane Gangsta Crip. Trey's moving. It's not that. It's Insane Crip Gang. Trey's. Am I wrong? Anybody that's been from LA, I'm not trying to say anything about it. I just need. Crip. All right. All right. So, boom. Me, my vocab is a little different. I don't. I, I, I use words for what they are because I'm trying to be a square. So, can anybody pull up the definition of off-brand for me? He basically trying to say he didn't mean it in a derogatory no, term. No, I got it. I'm going it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's I, I hate sense. to take over, but I have no, I need to do this because I apologize to these niggas uh, because I do know in the gang world that off-brand, listen, it says the unknown, not saying y'all unknown, unpopular or inferior brand of a retail product. So, that we gonna take, we're going to take the last part after the last comma, or the inferior brand of a retail product, right? Okay. The retail product is gangsters, because that's the card, right? So, gangsters is the card. Breaking it down for y'all. You guys don't have gangster in y'all name, but y'all trades. We know trades and gangsters are one of the same, right? But y'all really don't beef with everybody that the gangsters beef with in LA, right? So, with y'all still being in the car on the streets, but running with Long Beach in jail. Because also in jail, they don't sit at the table. They sit at the Long Beach table with all the long. What you guys think about Brick Baby's uh, reaction to his rant? We got Spotty Face and DW Flame pulling up on WAC 100. The content is about to get super exclusive, premium. Drop a comment down below. It's your boy Ray Gill. Let's get back to it. Yo, this is my first time speaking on speaking on it in general, period. You know what I'm saying? But, um, uh, I feel like it's like it's, it's the streets. Like, nigga, I'm gonna protect my imagery at all times, even though it wasn't initially. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't be courting it. Like, like, like I said, like in the other interview, my little bro did it. But I, at the same time, I stand on it, and I'm glad he did because the conversation that we had, he said one thing, and he turned around two hours later and started making videos about me again. If you notice. My last three interviews, I've been shouting Brick Baby out. Yeah, you, you said it on the interview we did. You was like, look, I don't yeah, got no man. problem with it, but he didn't stand on business on that phone call. Yeah, I've been I've been shouting them out like I ain't even been trying to because it, it be coming off as like a nigga cloud chasing or whatever. Nigga, I don't got a cloud chase. Like nigga, if if niggas do their homework on me and my little cousin, like we ain't got it that bro that we that. So you know what I mean? Like so when they start coming, that narrative been start um being pushed, I, I got away from it. I was trying to disassociate myself with the whole thing. But he made before I even put out that conversation, bro, he made like five videos about me. So at that point, it's like now you're trying to create a narrative and you running with it, and that wasn't it. <clears throat> that wasn't what he what it really was. You get what I'm saying? So I'm like, all right, you wanna you wanna do this? Like you know what I'm saying? 
up, nigga. You was just, you know what I'm saying, breaking your whole life story down to me. And you say you didn't want no problems. I was also on a phone call telling them, like, I'm not about to, if you notice, like, bro, I'm not about to be playing these internet games. Like, you, we pretending that it's up. You know what I'm saying? It's really not that. You get what I'm saying? So that phone call had, had that phone call had been, been recorded. I never released it until the nigga put out, like, five or six videos about this shit. You know what I'm saying? So, that's all that was but you know any nigga that say it was some police shit or some cop shit they can stand on it when they see me you feel me that's just like a motherfucker backbiting if a nigga say something if whack my homeboy on the yard and I and I, I and nigga say oh this nigga whack a bitch what the what the what blood woo, woo. what I'm gonna do I'm like hold on hey Hey, white, come here. This nigga calling you out your name. He's saying shit. That's that's what real niggas do, bro. You get what I'm saying? Don't say nothing behind a nigga back or don't say nothing that you can't stand on, bro. And I live on that. Like, he getting mad because he can't stand on what he said and it's fucking up his relationship, you know what I'm saying, with Flame. Flame caught the nigga Buster, you know what I'm saying, told the nigga he wanted to get out. And, you know, he. I guess that's why he crashing out. And that's what make him look bad because it looked like he most scattered that then his click and that's that's not a good look hey Blame hey Spody, I, I got these texts i got these texts in front of me and shit like can you explain like these texts he was talking about dealing with um dealing with four extra that's what he was saying tell tell your homie to stay up off me was yeah, it four extra I, I don't i don't i don't know nothing now. i don't even want to i don't even want to get into all that my whole thing is about is all these podcasters and all this saying whoever you know what i'm saying he just started a whole clan you know what I'm saying? As far as like, you know, oh, there was a police shit, some cop shit. Like, nigga, tell them niggas to stand on that when they see me. Other than that, I don't, I don't really see, care. See, me no, personally, though, care. bro, like, at the end of the day, like, I, I feel like this, bro. Like, okay, it happened. All right, cool. Bet it up. But, bro, anything you say on the phone privately or you say privately with your homie or something, you should be able to repeat that shit. You know what I'm saying? You should be able to see it ten times. Say once, say twice. Yeah, let me ask you a question. Tell me what's the difference. Tell me what's the difference. Tell me what's the difference when somebody backbite or say something about one of your homeboys, and you go get your homeboy and 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 let him know like what he just said. To me, a motherfucker, a motherfucker say, "Oh, you a real homie." Like you, you let him speak behind your homie back. Tell me, there's 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 no difference with that. Yeah, you talking about DW, right? He's saying that DW his homeboy. Exactly. He did so, some bust and shit. Yeah, he he, yeah, he would have yeah, never yeah. he would have never admitted that he said that shit he said if they would have had him on record. That's a fact and, and too. People, and, and people forget people forget before I put out that court recording. He put out six videos about me, bro. I, my whole my whole little shit. I, I've been trying to get off that. Like, man, I push peace. I'm on some other shit trying to uplift my community, build my community, bro. And he keep letting that dude over there. You know what I'm saying? Run with the narrative. Even you know after, saying? even after you, you think that he's the one who got your page deleted, correct? Yeah. So the same, so the same thing he he crying about as far as them running content, them running content on him on three days in a row. How you how you think I was feeling? You know how you think I was feeling when they he, him and his him and his posse. You know what I'm saying? They was running content about me, me constantly, constantly, and I wasn't saying nothing. I was trying to take the higher route. So the same shit he over there crying about. You know what I'm saying? He, but see the thing about it, he wanted them to suppress. He wanted to su- them to suppress it. You get what I'm saying? He, I, man, listen. When you, when you feel like you out there by yourself, if you if you notice, not one Rolling Sixty came to his defense. Out of all this all the spectacle, the circus that they did, turn to do. not one Rolling Sixty came to his defense, bro. So that's why he keeps saying, "My homeboy, my homeboy." He values that friendship with him and DW Frame more than anything for the, the simple fact. Know the that's truth, though, yeah. Spody, them niggas is content buddies. They ain't real. Homies. Hey, look, this is what I was thinking yeah, I'm, though. I'm, I'm, hey, Spotty Face, you know. this is what I was thinking though. Like, cause I know y'all was speaking on Crip Mac and shit, right? And y'all was saying like why he would do that. So I was saying like a scenario, like okay, you meet a motherfucker, you've been knowing him for two months, and you know what I'm saying he's from the opposition or whatever. And then he's saying little shit and you cool with him, right? But then you got your homie who that's from your hood that you got a relationship with and you don't you go in on your homie versus go in on I guess the op. You feel me? Is that, yeah. that that's how y'all feel about that whole Crip Max situation? Exactly what he did. I mean, I, I can't lift the words coming out of my mouth is is I'm speaking for myself at this point. I can't speak for a, a thousand people as far as me. As far as far as me, like I like I've been saying, I never really had a problem with the nigga. You know what I'm saying? As far as his friendship and his relationship with different hoods, because like I said, 
I, I got cousins and brothers as Don Moves. I, I fuck with the other side. Some of my best friends is from A Trey Gangsters and Hoos. They're my niggas, but at the same time, is you know, um, I, so, so I know how that go with a motherfucker slip up and shit like that. My whole thing is about it. He never said anything, so I, I wouldn't. I wouldn't really own that. The thing would really, you know, what I'm saying, that got me out there is when you don't have no type of energy for that. Him in a him him in a him in a bitch ass nigga. You know what I'm saying, Gordy. You feel me? You know what I'm saying. Um, Cutter had no type of you know what I'm saying energy towards them, but had all the energy in the world to Crip Mac. Give or take, everybody know you know what I'm saying Crip Mac history. You know, or whatever the case is, whether you hate him or you love him. He he his his life is an open book, homie. Yeah, he stand on that. He stand on that. And like he, he stand on that. like far as I know, like just outside looking in again, right? Like yeah. these guys that he called Faze with, bro, it sounded like they were some reputable guys, like niggas beating ass, you feel me? But he still decided to go in the ring and take his phase, you feel me? So yeah, lose, I mean, win, lose, or draw. I mean, that's like that's like you ask any 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 person in the room, you know what I'm saying, including whack. Like if you if you if you that just to me, everything that he do right now, you know what I'm saying, more power to that dude, bro. But you know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna keep beating a dead horse. But everything that he say or he does is a contradiction to me and it just make him look bad because that's just like whack, you no, know, if a nigga if a nigga go in a dorm, you telling me you gonna let your homie run five phases and get knocked out five yeah. different times. Yeah, that's what I said. Oh, like it's a such yeah. thing as yeah. back yeah. phase, yeah. right? Yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, let me land. Hold on, let me land. Cause a lot of people don't understand what the LA County Jail is like. I'm not talking about no other county county jail in California. I'm talking about the LA County Jail and how our politics work. I ain't gonna get into too much of that, oh. but at the same time is if my homie catching more than one fade. It's an automatic run back. Play. You're not running a homie more than once. Hey, I got it. All right, he got four phase. All right, go ahead. We're going back to back it. It, it. it doesn't matter. If it's just me and my homeboy, I don't matter how many homies. Are right, he going to get out? I'm going to get down there and so on and so forth. You give me a first and foremost, you know what I'm saying? A nigga not letting the homie get knocked out and I'm not doing that. So what was you back to? What, what was you doing when he was getting knocked out? Yeah, what he you was just yeah, so you he better bag up. You know what he was doing. We Come been on, there, man. nigga. You know that. We know exactly what Come that looks like. That, that, and that, I that, listening if a nigga saying, no, fuck that. I'm next with that nigga. Right? Then that, that turns into a melee, nigga. Then we just getting off. You're <laughs> not finna let a nigga run. <laughs> Your homie like, homie, I got you next. Nah. I'm like that. Then we just getting off. We just locking up. Now we just locking. That's just what that is. Yeah, so in my personal opinion, that explanation, what he was saying is like, oh, I, this thing, he was trying to smut, you know, or throw crit back under the bus. It's like, I, I, you know what I'm saying? I, I, that's the part that I appreciate. That's why I came in. It's like, hold up, bro. Like, you ain't even, you ain't even on this nigga. And it's another, that, that another narrative that's been brewing up in the start, you know what I'm saying? And I'm all that, you know, I'm all that flame, you know what I'm saying? Personally, I ain't gonna do all that, but I, I don't appreciate the narrative that's been around here. Just like he said, as far as like, oh, none of them niggas didn't ask you for a fade. They scary Larry. How? The only reason people be missing, the, people be missing the whole fact that me and my cousin, we the reason why DW Flame, you know what I'm saying, apologized to the whole neighborhood Crips. He wasn't even gonna apologize to the neighborhood Crips because Brick Baby was up there saying, Oh, this is my homeboy, he gotta do this, we gonna keep nah, nigga. What you what you talking about? I I hit up Flame on some many man shit. He didn't have none of that, no energy, no like we we neither neither one of us like that. Like, hey bro, what's up with that? You know what I'm saying? You were just around the homies, like, what's going on? He like, bro, I'ma fix it. This, this, that, and the third, and it was that. I respected him. I slipped up, bro. You know, not even trying to, not not saying that we marked him out or nothing like that. We just hollered as men. You get what I'm saying? And we gotta yeah. understand it. Keep back to the so, and we nipped it in the butt. So as far as a nigga talking about, as far as a nigga talking about a nigga that had that type of energy or a nigga that called Flame. If if you if you recall, I had two videos that go viral, went viral. One for Flame and one for Brick Baby. And I, for my for my understanding, I had the same energy to both of them. Right, right, you know and that, you know that that get lost, that get lost. So everybody be like, oh, they they oh they just own brick baby for um you know what I'm saying for not saying that, but they nobody on flame for saying something. Right? But you did, DW but you did have a conversation with uh with DW Flame, right? You did have a conversation with him, and like like if you could tell the people like how did that go? Like far as like you know what I'm saying, like because I understood like because that's why I brung up Crip Mac because I understood you was like yo we ain't even on that no more. You know what I'm saying? It's more so about Crip Mac, like how he gonna go against the homie like that. But like when you had that conversation with DW Flame, what that was about, bro? He just told you. 
it, it, it was it was quick, fast, and hurry. You know what I'm saying? He he replied once he seen my video. You he, he got in my he got in my DM like, oh bro, you know a nigga fucked up. I made a mistake. I know it be around your homie. I fuck with y'all, crib. That was that was that was it. I'm like, look, beat up didn't say. mean. Listen, bro. His intentions wasn't to to diss that nigga. I know nephew. He's real close to me, right? He like when niggas talk the way they talk all day, right? This is why Chuck. You notice I don't use a lot of lingo like that. You know what I'm saying? Because you a slip, right? I can be around the masters of them, and it ain't gonna never happen. All the most they gonna hear is Paul Rook. I don't even let. Yeah, so I know. Shit. I said that earlier. My whole boys can't even get on my phone and diss because I got real crip comrades. This is a fact. Because if you talking to me like that on this phone, when you come around in my studio, one of my niggas there, you gonna do that. And I'm going to feel the disrespect that they feel. I'm not a gangbanger. I'm just where I'm from. So whoever I'm with, whoever I'm with, that's who I'm with. No matter who they from, right? So you got to remember what um, um, D-Dub's position is, right? I ain't got a problem with issuing an apology because it wasn't done out of malice anyway. Where this nigga, Brick may be catching the heat at, is he didn't show no signs. A uh, no nothing to nothing, nigga. Certain words when you from a gang, we hear that motherfucker fitness be said before you say it. Like we we know it's coming, and we gonna automatically position, tense up, frown up, ball our fists up. You gonna do something? That nigga should have been like, homie, what's that? What you say? Anything, homie? What you talking about? Right? They ain't saying take off on him. We know you know the nigga. Nigga probably slip, but nigga, he just. Went head on and went on through with the motion like he ain't hear it. At least do a double take or something. Du yeah, doubles. But see, you heard him say, I didn't think the people heard it. But you heard it, nigga. At the bare minimum, don't get a nigga two of them motherfuckers. At least yeah. you get them one. God damn. Yo, yeah, I don't know. Hey, so so to clue my, my my little shit that I was I was saying as far as you know what I'm saying uh, uh flame is is that that's 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 the shit that I I don't like because when you when you when you hear somebody say that and you don't correct it or you niggas say oh niggas picking and choosing I'll be picking and choosing I got at you the same way I got at brick and when you got at me respectfully we had a man we had a conversation as two men and i understand your part understand niggas slip up you get what i'm saying but you know our conversation don't allow you no know, narratives to, to, to start brewing up bro or to start you know what i'm saying getting bigger than what it is and when you know you know we had the conversation that's why niggas ain't been on 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 flame hey, this niggas know. yeah what's up let me ask you a question bro did did you did you ask uh, Flame, was there a reason why he was using the, the N-word? Nigga, that's their daily combo. No, no, but hold on, hold on, hold on. That was, that was, that was, that's that was, not their daily was, combo because why is they having that daily combo when they don't be yeah. with neighborhood? All right, so, so, so look, so I did. They trades, bro. Come on, really? Yeah, yeah. Homie, so, I know, so I I know what they is, homie, but I'm You know that. Yeah. But yeah, so, trains, who saying? Come on, bro. You but Ridge, at the end yeah, of the bro, day, the I main, mean, the we, main we, thing we, is that the nigga yo, said he's let the nigga stand answer though, man. He ain't gonna stand on it because he ain't feel like nobody else heard. It. Nah, yeah, I know, but you know, as yeah, 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 I'm from the neighborhood. You feel what I'm saying? So I'm asking him, is there what was there a reason why he said why he used that type of language? Hey, flame on stage, flame on stage. Well, let him master it then. There it go. What's your question then? All right. The question was, since you, you use the N-word, right? Is that something that y'all use because you got y'all got beef with neighborhood? Or what how did that how does that get in the conversation about a cigarette? Or is that something you use as let, about let me, cigarettes all the time? Let me tell you how I, let me tell you how I get in the in the conversation. Basically, nigga, me hanging around certain individuals or my whole camp or whatever, niggas just the word just get passed around. So me coming up there, I'm chilling with brick so much. Mind you, I don't even smoke cigarettes like that. But when I get faded and drink, I do once in a while. So that ain't just it wasn't something that I just do. You feel me? It just. It came out because I was just niggas like, hey, DW, oh, pass me a, pass me a bop, and that's just how, how that came out. Boom! Once I caught myself, I stung. Like, I, 
nigga, I, trust me, I'll be at, I'll be with all type of niggas everywhere. So it ain't my regular thing, but nigga, like, you know, cause real niggas know that, cause I'm gonna say, niggas I've been with from both they sixties neighborhood up in jail, they slip up. Oh, DW, cause my bad, cause it ain't even like you get what I'm saying, like. So anything uh, else, yeah, I get it. Any, anything <laughs> else, a nigga, uh, anything else, a nigga just trying to blow something out of proportion. Cause real gangsters, like even all the, uh, come on, cause my neighborhood niggas like, cause D, oh, DW, cause like, whoa, whoa. But they know what type of level we on. They know that, they know what I what I meant, or they, I didn't mean, or whatever the fuck. Do you you know what I'm saying? Hey, flame. Yo, but I already just like I already did by the niggas like oh my bad or saying it more more than once was an issue for me with my niggas. You get what I'm saying? So as Cuz going through shit, I go through shit too, Cuz, and that's what whatever you feel me. So after that, that shit should be it should be fully the fully. That's why it was cool on my end. I talked to certain niggas. We all, everybody I talk with, niggas understood. We got an understanding and shit, I don't even know. I don't even know why it's only thing break flat. You know, you said it on stage. You said, listen, yeah. let's keep it for real, for real. Yeah, niggas hey, hey, already hey, had an yeah. issue with how he was representing himself way before this shit. Even niggas got an issue with cuz anyway. Yeah, that's so, Hey, 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 this Flody, bro. Hey, the, right. the only thing this, the, 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 all right, so, so the narrative, so the, yeah, so the narrative that's pushing right now, just like I just told them, bro. As soon as, as soon as a nigga see my video, bro, tell me if there's any lies told, bro. As soon as a nigga see my, my video, you hit me up, like, bro. You know what I'm saying? Um, you know what I'm saying? Nigga gonna fix that shit, bro. That was my bad. I you, had to slip I, up. What I think you first. Oh, as soon as I seen your video, you I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't remember. But, but listen, I, it, it doesn't. It doesn't matter. A nigga had a conversation as a man. Nigga told you. Oh man, nigga understand. But the, the, the narrative is pushing right. that a nigga never. That we our community never said nothing to you. We just understood because you stood on business as a man. Like nigga, nigga slipped up, bro. Nigga fuck with y'all. Like you feel me? And we understood that. You get what I'm saying? But the narrative, the narrative that that's been pushing right now and, and some shit that was said I I, I, I seen what we you know what I'm saying when old boy he like um or niggas is picking and choosing nigga um I mean um um niggas is scary Larry but who said, said that brick though hold on hold on who said though. that brick hold on hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on for a second. So, hold yeah, on, hold on. Yeah, right. Niggas, niggas uh, is scary. Niggas is scary. Larry. Trying to get you know it off him, and you you, you No, no, but listen, though. But Flame, you replied, bro. You you replied, though. As you said, yeah, niggas is picking and choosing. I just wanted to know. I, I, you. I, I, I'm going to get you up anyway. Like, who, who are you saying? Like, picking and choosing. Cause I thought we had that settled already. You know what I'm saying? Look, me, and, me, and you, me and you ain't got no more back and forth to do about no bullshit, nigga. I don't... Whatever cuz gassing up about, whatever cuz gassing up about, that's his issue to address. You know, whatever cuz saying, nigga, if you pay attention, when there's too much bullshit going on, I say less. Cause I, when I say something, that's what I'ma say. When I say, when I talk to you, that was the conversation we had. Cause I don't go back after that. I don't be. That's why I never broke it up again. Yeah, exactly. Nigga, once I once I have a conversation with you, that's that's just like what I was telling Brick. When the conversation did come out, I'm like, damn, cuz I thought we had a understanding. You get what I'm saying? So with anybody I ever talked to, which I ain't talked to too many niggas, I just, you know, anybody that, okay, cool. When you post your video, boom, you or we inbox, however, bam, cuz that was that's where it was at. That's where we ended that. But we, 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 we got our understanding. You never spoke on it again, correct? Two, we, three. We, we I don't understand. Me and you asked me, we already had an understanding, correct? That's because that's because I from the get go, I was nigga, I was just being myself talking. You feel me? Or just keeping it deep, whatever the fuck, and then that slip both caught myself. I caught myself like a gangster. You feel what I'm saying? Oh, Spody, hold on, D Dub Spody. Spody, listen. Yeah. You've been doing this shit for me, right? Yeah. I know some people may think I'm overstepping my boundaries, but I'm not because I got family on both sides of where you niggas from. And if anything get weird, I'm going to get the blame for it because you in here, I'm in here, this nigga in here, right? End of the day, you heard who mouth that came out of Spody, and you know why he said it because he's trying to get the light off him and put it on some other shit. So that shit don't even need to be talked about because then it's working in his favor. 
You know what you and DW conversation was. Both you niggas solid niggas. You niggas are standing in the middle of the street and beat each other till y'all both fall. Y'all both know y'all y'all riders, right? So it ain't no even sense in going there because he ain't looking for no clout or no brownie points off of saying some shit he didn't say. And you definitely ain't running from it. So if that came out of brick mouth, that's brick trying to push some shit somewhere to get it off of him. Leave that shit over there with that nigga. Ain't no sense to you and him being cops. He's mad because he got caught playing the 50, though. The only only, only thing I had a problem with is, like, to me personally, if a nigga say something, I agree a thousand percent. My whole thing is about if a nigga say something about Flay to me, it doesn't matter, nigga. I'm I'm still like, nah, hell no. Like, nigga, he, that's how I, I, any my video, would every, any time they ask about Flame, like, what happened with that, I'd never say, like, bro, do you know Flame? No, you ain't no buster. I'll get a nigga to Bro, you know that though, right? You know, you know, Flame. No, you ain't no Buster Flame. No, you know he ain't one. Y'all out. Y'all, y'all both know each other's pedigree. Both of y'all. But, but look, I get clearly, clearly. He's does. saying that when the nigga Brick said it. Oh, you should have shut it down, Flame. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You said uh, you said I should have shut it down. No, he said when Brick said niggas is picking and choosing, right? He put he kind of felt like you should have said, well, me and Spoda are uh, me and Spody already hollered or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Tell what you know, they 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 letting, letting everything up off Cuz chest that Cuz had on his chest. I'm letting Cuz go. I was waiting on my word to speak, period, on how I felt. Uh, about about shit so i'm like yeah okay go ahead go ahead go ahead so like that's the whole thing with this internet shit because i don't niggas can misinterpret shit or whatever like i said after i said shit to anybody because that's just where it was at because dw don't play weird games i don't go back and forth i don't try to twist i didn't whack ain't put me up to nothing to try to slide no weird shit i don't know what niggas be thinking I don't want a nigga. I don't. Hey, D-W. That's not hey, D-W. a good look. That's hey, not D-W. a good look. Let me ask you. Wait, though. wait. Hold on, Chuck. First of all, D-Dub. Right? Anytime you do something, I remotely feel you going the wrong way. Do I call you? Yeah. I call him like an uncle. Like, this is my... I got strong ties over there. Right? This with, with his big brother, with his G homies, all that. And they going to blame me for this nigga. This a, and my bullshit, I'm going to get the blame. Yo, right. whack, woo, 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 nigga, like, you know, that's your family right there, so I'm never going to tell him to go at another crib. I'm never going to tell him to diss another crib. He ain't going to even let me tell him no type of shit. This nigga didn't walk yards, control yards. This nigga ain't no little kid. It's a big old youngster that's a real gangster, right? So at the end of the day, right, ain't no whack control. What whack did do was open the door, put in the word, get him in position like right. I do for a bunch of motherfucking crips. You want to know who catch the heat? Spody, you know. Nigga ain't been a nigga in my shoes since death row. And he was fucking over him, right? Who don't mind if the nigga, if that's who it is, put the nigga in place regardless of his neighborhood. Right? Ask, Spody, can I ask you a question, though? Yeah, absolutely. So, with you putting out, uh, was that call? Was that call? Because was that call a long time ago when that shit first happened? Or was that a new call? Nah, that was um not when it first happened. That was like um I'm gonna say a new call because it been up. I had it for weeks. Um, so you had it for weeks. So if that 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 so that cousin, 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 ain't this, he ain't just this, this, right? Look, look, let me let me let me put it in context because I I can't put exact date on it. But as far as it was not too long, that shit was like not too long after it happened because initially, initially. A nigga try to be, before it get out of hand. Niggas like, man, this shit get out of hand, bro. Let's hurry up and try to. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, the, the homie got him on the phone. So I'm telling the nigga like, bro, hey, look, this the only problem. If you if you notice the whole conversation, bro, we not getting loud. We not talking. We talking regular. So you get what I'm saying? So we had came into the clue conclusion like, hey, look, bro, you, I, I, if you hit the conversation, I give him action like, bro, I'm about to be. I don't do the internet shit. I don't know how this shit work. I'm not gonna call you out your name. I know what I did. I know what I said. So I'm not gonna be one of these niggas on the internet that, that you know what I'm saying, call you out your name and you never see. I'm gonna give you action at me, bro. So whenever you get ready, like you know what I'm saying, we can meet up, do whatever. If you wanna just have a conversation, whatever, however Cub wanted to do it. You you feel what I'm saying, bro? Okay, so, okay. and look, one more thing. Y'all, go, y'all go. I I will say I think you were in the wrong for y'all being neighborhoods in the convo getting out. Man, that's not my homie, bro. At, at the same time, I he's my homie you, from neighborhood. But I, listen, listen they, they, hold on. I, I, that, that's the, a lot of people say that, but let, let me let me land when you say that. If if he was playing fair, bro, 
you 1000% right, bro. But listen, after the, listen, after we had that conversation, bro, you could go look on his page. You guys, anybody, he put a video up, bro, going against everything we had just came to agreement with. Two hours later, bro, he ran five, he ran five or six videos about me, bro. The same shit that he was, was over out, the crowd. That was bro. out there no jumper shit, right, Spody? Yeah, like, um, yes. Yeah, so, so, so after, after, after that shit, um, that conversation. Yeah. He's like, bro, you already did what you did. Just leave it alone. What do, what do, what? So I left it alone, bro. But he ran like five or six videos about me, bro. You see what I'm saying? So you telling me at, at some oh, point yeah, I gotta right, protect right, my right, energy? Right. He, 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 y'all he, he, y'all he, making it personal, right? yeah, yeah, I told niggas. I said, bro, I said, I ain't his homie. Yeah, yeah, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let, let me finish. I'm, I'm, I'm not about to keep letting a nigga go in on me, bro. You want, you want, you on one of the biggest platforms in America, bro. You're control, you're driving the narrative, you're controlling the narrative, bro. You get what I'm saying? So after like five or six videos, he came saying, "Oh, you the weird nigga." Him and phone, yeah, I'm cool. I watch all them videos is after the conversation, bro. You gotta understand, five or six. What I'm supposed to do, bro? Yeah, right, I mean, right. now, now you take you take the homie equation out because now you you bashing me on the internet, you going in on me on the internet, nigga. I don't gotta play fair with you. My I'm, thing is, I'm fucked up. He never I'm took like accountability that. for letting him say that. Really, I'm like, like I don't know if niggas it. homies or not. Like I, I I'm up here like because I don't know if I'm the only nigga keeping it thorough. Like when I say something, like I mean that. Like and then I'm trying to figure out, like damn. Is niggas on, <laughs> on cuz or like I really think niggas should be like okay cuz you know them two niggas right there them two niggas is the way in right now or is, is, is that, and that, that that if you listen bro that's what but I'm it saying. look like niggas going against man, everything man, we man, trying man, to man. My, my, my bro, I just did I, Alex Alonzo, bro, Dream Four, um, Death of a Clock, all all them, bro, on the de- all them. I just did four interviews, my, and you look at any, every interview. I'm like, man, shout out to Brick Baby, that man, that's the homie. I wish him nothing but success, bro. And, and, and he keep dropping videos about. Yeah, look, just go look it up, bro. I got to see those. I he, see yeah, those. He, he definitely, definitely, bro. He definitely said that. Like if we did an interview actually Sunday, bro, and I guess the clip dropped maybe Tuesday, and he was saying like, look, man. You know, so I don't got no problems with Brick Baby. We asked him about DW Flame, you. You know what I'm saying? He was like, look, I don't got no issues with him. You know what I'm saying? We already spoke. But the only thing is, with Brick Baby, he ain't standing on business. He ain't standing on what he said he stand on. You know what I'm saying? Like, 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 D-Dub, D-Dub, you got to remember, D hey, One, one thing you being cut, being cut, homie, say, say, say it was you in the, in the chair, right, dog? Say it was you. And by, I flip by, like, cause if me and you bros and we really county jail thugging or now we working, this is, I would say, a little bigger than that. Like, at the, you know, with our life at the time. So, by, cause it's like, or a nigga could have, a nigga, he could have tapped me, like, cause let me holler at you outside, like, real quick or whatever, fuck. You know what I'm saying? But we would have still came down and said to the table, but I wanted to know exactly what niggas. You know, wanted cuz to do cuz to keep it 3,000. If cuz would have slipped like that, I would have caught cuz like, hey, cut, cut, oh, or just real quick, but I would have kept it low real quick. Oh, but I wouldn't, I'll, I wouldn't I'll, have I'll, did I'll, nothing. Let me ask you the question, bro. Let, 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 let me answer this question. I'm glad you asked me because people just make it seem like all the gangbangers is just stupid motherfuckers. We don't understand the work. That's what I'm, that's what I'm saying. Really working. So I'm glad you asked. I said that was actually a good question. So my whole thing is about is like, like I just told them before this, some of my best friends from A Trade Gangster, some of my best friends are moving. Nigga, some of my best friends. Nigga, I got cousins that's that's Don Moose, and you think I don't get my ears cracked? But I'm, we we, we talking about you down on a national platform, bro. The problem that I have with you is not. I don't even have a problem with you. You know what I'm saying? With you, with, as far as with you, when, when you slipped up, because I know how that go. The problem that I had is you on a platform, bro. And I I wanted you to be like, man, you around the homies. You know you be around the homies, or you be in certain events, and niggas don't be up on you like that. My whole thing is like, even though I know the the the, the, the trays, you know what I'm saying, in in a, in, a, in, a, in a, or or whatever that is. But I didn't want it to be a gang war. You got homies that live in my hood. I got homies that live in Long Beach. You know what I'm saying? We fuck with each other, even though niggas, we fuck with each other. So that's why I just wanted him to be like, damn, bro. Just, you know, the homies like, man, damn, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Say something to let the community, because you got to understand, you got trades and neighborhoods in all 50 states, bro. Even out the country, so I don't want these. You know what I'm saying? That's that. that people look at Todd like I told him. Whether you want to be or not. On that platform, bro, you speaking for the homies because you're that you rep you that representation. That's a but Spody, but Spody, here go the thing though, right? Whether they qualify, it couldn't have been a problem with D Dub because D Dub apologized on camera. 
Yeah, they, no, 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 nobody. No, no. L- l- he listen, apologized listen. on camera. So what more else after that? Anything <laughs> after that? You know, hold, on, hold, on, hold on, hold on, my bad. I didn't, I didn't hear my, my play, baby. Play, my, play, I, play, I just play. had to grab my baby. So go, go ahead. I said at that point, Flame, you wasn't the problem because once you said that and he didn't check it, all right, now the beef is not with you no more. It's about him. What I like, damn, bro, at least homies just niggas just want to say that. Yeah, niggas said that in that interview. Let, let us know, let you know what I'm saying, let us know that that y'all, you know what I'm saying, as far as the people who don't know in LA, like it ain't nothing, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying, that could start a whole war. That's all I was saying, bro. And then you be around the homies, you know, you done ran into clean homies, niggas, and welcome you with open arms. And they go like, well, damn, Flame, you well, know, I, I understand. But you I, I, and, 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 and it ain't just, it ain't just your homies that uh, I welcome them niggas too. So that's it's why, it, that's it, why we it, do it. have understanding. Like, you know, it's been a situation where niggas with me and we good. I got niggas like, nigga, all day with DWI, Dynasty, Woo Woo type niggas. Yeah. Like, like that, so so, and that was the same niggas that I that I played. That's, yeah. that's why niggas it never carried out. It never got that far with you. If you notice, when niggas had that conversation, niggas nipped it in the bud because right. niggas respect you, bro. That's like what they niggas said on the interview too, though. And it's bro. That's why it never got that far, and that's why people creating the narrative are like they don't have no energy towards flame, but they got all the energy yeah, towards. And we're so crazy just because just because of the way. Oh myself, niggas be oh niggas they they create. Narratives about everything. Flame this, flame this. Somehow my name get brought up in everything. When the when the main thing I'm doing, I'm really you know focusing and getting back on track type shit or staying on track. But the, it's everybody painting all type of narratives, uh, all type of bullshit, nigga. I'm I'm a gangster. That's it, nigga. I'm a gangster who, nigga, who's literally podcasting now. So I, that means I'm going to a whole different. Different route. Every so this nigga better, better, better. Every, every nigga better find a route to go in. Yeah, this this is way too much drama for niggas. Need to know how to shut shit down at the front door. That's why even like on me when I do it, or Brick need to shut shit down at the front door too. Like he could have hollered at y'all, nigga, I'm, and shut it down because it already got too far. To the, if to Brick would have came out there and hollered at them niggas when they pulled up, it would have been dead. And that's what I was thinking too, because that's what Crip like. I say like some people say Crip Mac slow, right? But Crip Mac, that whole situation when that shit got leaked on Facebook, or whatever, right? Crip Mac immediately went to the hood, called his DP. By the time that she was going viral, guess what? Hey, I already called my DP. What y'all talking about? You know what I'm saying? That's how, yeah. That's how you. That's how you handle shit too. That's how you handle it for sure. That's how I'm handling. You stand on business, but again, I, I'm gonna say this last thing, man. I, I gotta get up out of here, but uh, my whole thing, I, I wanted to come up here because it's the first time I reply like to any nigga, even even you, Flame. You say you feel I was wrong. All right, that's that, that's fine. I like I I. I, I know, no, I'm saying gotta, if that's your yeah. homie, if that's your homie, I felt like you was wrong. If y'all not homies, but you saying yeah. the homie feels some type of way. Absolutely. If if I am boosting, if I am boosting with that, I agree with you one thousand percent. But you take the homie, you take the homie piece off the board. When you still running content and you go and you go against everything that we had in this conversation, I thought it was over. If you listen to the conversation, he said, I don't got no problem with you, or whatever the case is, whatever it is, all right. But then you go run six, seven videos about me. The same shit that you you crying about on, on no jumper that Adam doing. And you say, I love you, Adam, but this the boss. You ain't got no problems with him doing it. But you 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 getting on the staff and everything about you, you trying to suppress that, but you trying to go in on me when you know you got a bigger platform than I do. But you recorded him before he did all that. Exactly. That's what I, 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 no, he no, no, put no, it out, then, nigga. He, he, he listen. He put Record he put out bro. five or six videos before I dropped that video. So go look at his page. Yeah, he was right, still spinning. No, hey, I barely, I, I barely just heard that. You heard, but hey, the thing is, though, Spody, you were you was holding it though, cause Spody, did you record him before he did the five six videos, Spody? I mean, huh? Before he. Before he did those five or six videos, did you already have that record? Yeah, I had it. I, I didn't have it in my Okay, own. so Spody, this is what it is, Spody. I got to call a spade a spade. Nigga, nigga, y'all targeted the nigga to take him down. <laughs> all you was blind. Call it what you want, Spody. I don't give a fuck. What is, what is, <laughs> and listen, if that's what it is, that's what it is. That was a good nigga. chess move. Yeah. That was a good chess move. <laughs> If that was the case, I would have came. I, I did the group. Like I said, everybody got their personal opinion. If that was the case, I would have came out the gate with that. Nah, nah. Cause I think Cody, like, like you said, nah, 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 nah. We all strategic. 
Because you coming out the gate with it would have crucified you. And then you, you needed a reason to use it. But you recorded it before it was even a reason to record it. Which I get it. I mean, I, 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 so listen, I get it. So you recorded it when y'all were still homies, basically. They ain't, no, they ain't never been his homie. Smokey already didn't identify him as what it is. He just ain't said it. No, all right, all right listen, y'all, I'm not, I'm not gonna let y'all tell me what I, what I was thinking. So, so, nigga, you I, recorded I, him before, I, it, nigga. No, listen, I never, I never, I never recorded him. The, the homie recorded him. I was just talking to him. Okay, on the phone. well, who, whoever, whoever recorded him, recorded. Hey, hey, Spotty face. Was that after yeah. you appeared on the black box with Spider Low? Yeah, that oh, was the phone thing. call that they said. I think it was before. Nah, I think man, that was before. It was, it was before? Was that before or after you went up to No Jumper? Y'all went up to No Jumper and he didn't come out. Um, you said it was before. Oh, no, 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 that was that was after. That was after. Yeah, that was. Okay. That was after. Oh, but see, now if it was after that, that, was that I got to take some off for you. Because at that point, it already is what it is. Yeah, Thanks. that was after. That was after. Got, yeah, so that's bro. Yeah, but so now we got a proper timeline. If it was after they went up to No Jumper, that nigga refused to come holler. At that point, he already was identified how they identified it. They wasn't seeing him as a homie no more. Yeah, because if it was yeah. before, then then Spotty bogus. But if it was after, yeah, it was after. It was after. It was I'm after they went up to No Jumper. I, I'd have had it. I'd have, like I did before all this blew up and all that. Nah, hell no. But after No Jumper, hey, matter of fact, that was even that. That was even after the black box. That's why I, I you know, I'll take that That's, back. That was definitely after the yeah, black yeah, box. Yeah, yeah. He said that he wanted to talk box. to you. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It was after the jumper, and then it was Spider. Like, oh, we gonna get y'all together, whatever the case is. And yeah, that was at, that was after that. So that was after no jumper in a, in a black box. That's and then, right. That's yeah, right. That, that, was, that was after that. But shit, nigga, run content on me. It is what it is, bro. You you take that homie piece off the thing. If that was, I would came out. The oh, it was game hey, on. Hey, hey, Spody, hey, Spody, hey. don't leave yeah. yet, bro. We about to run some content. So yo, yo, DW Flame. Hey, did your brother yoke up that nigga, um, Brick Baby, in that studio? I already okay. put it out no. there, Flame. Yeah, hey, I know. Nephew gave me the green light. No, I already no told him. No comment. <laughs> did, he, did, he, did he apply pressure? Did he grab bad sex? No, no. Hey. <laughs> no comment is as good as a yes. Yo, <laughs> I'll stay on mute. Hey, DW Flame, though. Hey, hey, what else, Pody? Hey, 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 hold on, what you say? Hey, 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 let's get this straight. Hold on, hold on one second. Right, what you say, is Pody? Let's get this straight. Hey, hey, hold on, hold on. My brother, my brother, my brother. What up, D Dub? Hold on, D Dub. What you say, Pody? I said. I said you was you was you, you was trying to make it seem like you know what I'm saying it was an ambush or something like that, and we was just only to take it. No, you been watching me, uh, huh? I, oh, nigga. You been studying me, nigga. You did right, I ain't. nigga. You better be ready. <laughs> studying you, nah, I ain't been studying you. Nigga. Oh, you a mother? Okay, what you was gonna say? I was a nigga that what? You admitted for all. I'm, I'm here. You you the nigga admitted it. They there it go. <laughs> you ain't lying. <laughs> you ain't lying, nigga. You better be ready for these niggas. Hey, bro. Hey, it's hard for a nigga to fight himself, Sporty. Sporty, it's hard for a nigga to fight himself. Nigga come lying, I'll be like, you sure that's what it is? Watch yeah. this. It's yeah. hard for a nigga a nigga lie, lie, lie. Yeah. So, so you got to. In this game we in, yeah. nigga, I don't do it. It's a whole lot of shit I got, right, that a nigga never hear. But if a nigga get out of pocket, oh, so you saying... You show, I'm going to let a nigga lie again two more times, and then I'm going to let him fight himself. He's going to wake up at midnight, and everybody going to be blowing his phone up. Hey, uh, hey, right, listen, uh, I'm, I'm going to uh, say this. Hey, one. look, uh, and back on that, uh, back on that little <laughs> subject, my, 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 brother only, yeah, your brother. Only gra- my brother only grabbed Brick because his baby in the building, you inviting people up here. He grabbed her like, hey, you stupid ass nigga. Your baby up here, like, you know. D-Dub, if you're going to tell the story, I'm going to tell the whole story. So you want to keep it no comment? Hey, D-Dub, D-Dub, way up, Chuck. D-Dub, D-Dub. you want to keep it no comment or we going to tell the whole? Because you know I talk to nephew. I know about to come outside. I know about everything. I know. But you want what we go no comment. What you want we doing, D-Dub? Man, we're going to leave this shit out no comment. <laughs> 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 
But basically, yeah, they don't, that's, that's, like, that's honestly, the though, bro, that's they don't make no sense, though, because if, if, like, even with that going on, bro, he having all that pressure for, like, I guess his homies, right? right. Even, like, if, even if he don't say to them his homies, they from the same neighborhoods, right? At the yeah. end of the day, bro, that shit crazy, bro. We talking about, we talking about, we talking about, <laughs> just, just some of the shit Cub was saying was very outlandish, Cub, like, but because, <laughs> because, mind you, Cub, on the set, I'm a, I'm thinking I'm leaving the set to come to podcast, cause you know what I'm saying. <laughs> so niggas like, yeah, cause come up here. I'm like, cause I'm a BRG. You know my my baby mama up here, cause like, what are you? What are, yeah, he cause see when Brick Holland come up here, D Dub's position is. I don't even I, though I, I know I'm supposed to leave at nine. No, I can't just leave at nine, cause it's gonna look like I'm running. Yeah, I, I, I'm a and I, look. I'm a G, but I, I don't, I don't crash, gang, <laughs> at all. I move, I move smart, and I move, I move great. You feel me? Enough way to keep, make sure that I keep moving. But so I'm just like that's that was just too hey, out of pocket. Hey, hey, hey B Dub, do you feel like the drugs is having an influence on the homie, which is I, making him make all of these funny style ass moves? Nah, you want to know something? I just, I just figured out that. D Dub don't know what be going on sometimes, cuz some <laughs> shit be, certain shit be planned out, cuz certain shit be real, certain shit be fake, <laughs> So if hey. you pay attention, nigga, I I sit and I look. I be like, okay, okay, cuz. <laughs> yeah, cuz you look like you was like, what's going on with cuz right now? You I was even like, you know, shit you when didn't Gordy was leave talking off about the that. Couch. DW didn't even get off the couch when DW is off. sitting there scratching his head saying, saying, okay, what's, wait up. All right. Well, let me sit back because I don't know what the fuck going on. Adam I'm a man. Let him go. You know what the fuck man, because hey, as soon as I came in, the nigga Gordy was talking talking shit about cuz he like I'm gonna push the narrative, but still I don't even know what that means. Like uh, just the way they start coming, I didn't even know they was gonna start talking bad about cuz. So I'm like, uh, I don't know. Is niggas trying to get me to say something weird or what's going on, cuz? Like. So I, but I figured out that you know they playing that out. I'm like, uh, I don't know what's real. So Brick and Gordy was running the play, nigga. They put it on the internet. They definitely said they. They wasn't running no play. They they didn't want to make it look like they didn't want to. You got to remember, he got limited resources when it comes to standing with him. So that nigga came in there the next day. Chuck, we the king of this shit, ghost. You know that, bro. This is looking bad. <laughs> we gonna be tell the niggas I told you. We gonna tell niggas I told you to do that because you sitting here. Acting like I'm I'm scared to pull up because he here or whatever, whatever. Ain't a good look, homie. We supposed to both be this, this, that, and other. Because, nigga, that ain't nothing you play with. That ain't no play you run. I didn't even on know why homie. they were saying that. I'm like, why the fuck they keep saying that? That ain't a play you run on your homie, nigga, at all. I you don't even troll why, like that. Why the, why the nigga Gordy not don't never go to a supposed hood, though? That's what I want to know. Where Gordy supposed to be yeah. from? I don't, I don't know nothing. Tell he, tell he take, take Brick Baby Dick out of his sp- mouth, nigga. He's supposed to be from Rolling Hunters. Oh, okay. Well, I don't nigga not from Hunters. Hey, B Dub, this the the big question of the day, right? And I, I thought about it. I was like, I bet you that D Dub ain't gonna have motherfucking Brick Baby on his Thursday. Hey, show. Uh, my show, my show, my show, I'm a, my show ain't gonna have none of that. It's gonna have good entertainment and, and women and shit like that. Yeah, I bet. <laughs> we get enough of that. So. Mm, no, he's gonna be all right. That's you all right anyway. I'm yeah, I'm fine. No, I'm like, really, ain't I'm saying fine. he ain't all right or none of that. Like I, I get it. I get what he got going on. Honestly, I get everything. Wax, you know that. Oh, but but at the end of the day, I was like wondering, like. He got a Thursday show. I'm thinking they forced. They they basically told Brick Baby that he gonna be on his um um statements, right? No statements. Oh, no, uh, no statements is they show, but at some time I yeah. But I'm them. saying though, how you get on no statements? They probably push you on that. No, bro. Baby. Listen, he came in the building, right? Me and Adam did the interview with him to see how it's gonna work out, right? Me and Adam both agreed. Listen, he a great character, great personality, right? And Adam Crip Mac had just went to jail, so Adam played. He placed him in that seat, right? Was sitting in that seat. He then became even bigger personality, 
You know, he probably about six months to a year ahead of himself. And now he's steamrolled into his own show. Right, but he Brick Baby ain't gonna be on his show. Like, they ain't got nothing to do with his show. Hey, hey, you he don't have on this show who he want on this show. Nah. Who keeps saying that? Big Chuck up there. He 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 <laughs> Chuck, <laughs> Chuck Bussy. <laughs> no, that's his show. The whole design is for him to get his spot, his slot. Wack is a great teacher. And I like all of my students to become teachers. The only way you can teach a student to be a teacher is to put their ass in the driver's seat. Now I ain't in the driver's seat. Y'all anticipate Brick Baby uh, being unemployed anytime? I mean, I don't know. I don't know what's going on with that. Right. All I know is right. he just I don't got know what's going on. You know better than that. He just no. did another podcast. No, you don't never not know. I don't know nothing, man. I, just, just, I don't know why this nigga ain't been to court in nine months with a K case with the feds. I don't know. You know? I don't know. Nigga, I'm telling Adam I need to relocate while I do my shit. That nigga know shit. I don't know. That nigga got went to jail June 23rd. Ain't been to court yet. I don't know. I don't know. But trip back in there for a handgun with a switch. I don't know. Yeah, that's what I was asking you, like, how that work? And you know how that work. Everybody know how that work. Motherfuckers ain't crazy. If a motherfucker ain't took a shower for four months and went to the bathroom and came out and he's smelling fresh and clean and the nigga tell you still ain't showered, you gonna believe him? No, nigga, you got in that shower, nigga. Yeah, you, 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 you know how that work. You go to jail, you go to court. Nigga, six months, seven, eight, not, we on nine months. No court date. Then he lied and told everybody it was LAPD till I applied the pressure and he cracked and told the truth it was a fair case. Fuck you lying for, nigga. The feds pick whack. What's happening? Feds just picked me up. I got a whoop-whoop case, nigga. They ain't doing no lying. You ain't got no ankle monitor on. You ain't got nothing. You ain't got no court date, no ankle monitor. You telling niggas, come up here right now. Everybody's up here out the outside, hiding under the cars and in the trees. Nigga don't know what's going on, bro. Hey, Wack, let me ask you this question, bro, and I'm going to end this room, right? This this the thing, though, right? Like, when it comes to Brick Baby and No Jumper, you you see longevity? You think he's going to be around? I, don't, they I don't know, bro. All I know is what I'm doing. What I'm doing is up there to bring new personalities and expand the brand, bring other things to the brand, which I'm doing, right? I'm expanding the brand, right? Bringing other segments and other sections, other attachments outside of what Adam has already built. That's it. I don't know what little dude do. They didn't, they asked me for three months. Why let him come interview what you interview? Nah, because then he taps into what I do, and I don't fuck with dude because dude is weird. Period. Right? One minute he acting like it's a problem, then the next minute he like yo tell Adam Wack tell Adam tell Wack let me come sit with y'all man like come on man let nah nigga. That's that shit Spody was talking about. That's why they recorded his motherfucking ass. Nigga, one minute you talking like this, and then you go get on the thing and talk like that. He like all the rest of them. I wouldn't fuck with him, so that's the conversation you get. I'd have let that nigga come sit in that seat with me once or twice and did all that with him. Oh, he'd be a whack fan. Oh, damn, we forgot the one person, man. One person that's involved, right? Yael, Yael. What's up with y'all? I, here, I told y'all. Y'all didn't want to believe me. Whack always capping. First he said it didn't happen. First he sat there like he didn't know nothing about the reality show for damn near a month. Then I come in the room on the nigga. He starts screaming. I didn't give nobody no consent to use some. Then he said it didn't happen. Then he said uh, it was staged. Right? Then I start putting up the clips and shit, teasing him and shit. And then y'all seen the whole fight. It was that stage? That nigga was hollering, screaming, some stage. other shit. That nigga had punk in his. That nigga was hollering, oh my, oh, all this shit, right? Hey, nigga, like, what you mean, stage? So, like, you know like when you, when, like, your opinion on Yael, what do you think about Yael? Like, your opinion. Like, your Bro, opinion. his homies had already called and told me, whack, we done ran him about the set. Right, but here goes another guy. Hey, whack, can I come to the studio? Hey, whack, I did a song with your artist. Can you clear it? Hey, whack, he didn't, 
he been having a problem with me since he was talking about Roddy. And I said, nah, bro, I don't think you'll say that to Roddy if he was in here. Well, that nigga, he's scared. He won't come. To, uh, I tell him to come to the clubhouse. He going to pull up. You gave no, me that viral moment. I, I made him pull up. Roddy came in and told him. I'm only here because Wack told me to come here. And now you mad at me because Roddy did what he did with you. Nigga, you the one told me to bring him. He been mad ever since. That's crazy, but I I seen I know what is going on. That's crazy. Damn. I mean, but at the end of the day, he done told y'all. First of all, he act like he didn't know Loose Cannon. Then he was on two, three episodes of the fight, other shit series. Then when Big U came in there talking about it, he still didn't speak that he's part of the motherfucking reality show. I came in there and said, nigga, why you ain't told these people you're on a reality show? He denied it, lied, then said it was a motherfucking uh, skit, it was staged, all that. You know, it was supposed to came out last week. I made him stretch it a week, and then there y'all have it, nigga. And where he at? Hey, whack. You Drop a comment down below. Let me know what y'all think about the content. Break baby, DW Flame, Spotty Face, Whack 100, and salute to Big Chuck and Death of the Cloud Tracers. Please subscribe to his YouTube channel. The link is in the description below, man. Shout out to Ghost. You guys, make sure you guys pull up over there and give them some support, man. They bring some great content, and they're going to run up the numbers. And I'm here for it, man, for real. But what do we learn from this situation? Communication is key. Somewhere in the midst of things, it was lost. And now they're trying to get it back by having dialogue and conversing right because at the end of the day that's all we can do is dialogue and try to get an understanding and perspective on where people is coming from you feel me but my message to the people man stay out the streets say no to drugs keep your best foot forward make the most of your 24 hours stay down until you come up put some hustle behind that muscle and get to it it will be greater later it's gonna be a grind Nobody said it was going to be easy. And ain't nobody going to hand you nothing. What? Ain't no handouts in life. You don't have to go earn that. You feel me? And I'm not talking about no shoebox money. I'm talking about money that comes with a pay stub. Where you can actually do some legitimate business with. Right? So, with that being said, keep your best foot forward and stay down until you come up, man. Apply yourself. Be proactive. You dig? But until next time, please keep that notification bell turned on so you don't miss out on no premium content. Like the video, share the video, drop a comment. It's your boy Ray Given. I'm gone. God bless. Peace. Thanks for watching another reaction video. I'm out.